Here, I just thought I'd show you guys my solar tracker I made here. What it is, is it's got two eyes here. One eye here, one eye there. And that's just put up there for now, for uh, just for testing. I'm just testing this unit out. I built it uh, with some solar or uh, satellite dish parts. The big satellite dishes with the actuator. And eventually I'm going to track it and it's going to... It's going to go up and down and back and forth, left and right, to, to track the sun. And what I've done, you can actually hear it running right here. It just ran for a second there, tracking the sun. If I move the eye, you can see that it starts to move. The whole thing is moving now. If I let go, it'll move back towards the sun slowly. I basically made it uh, inside the black box here. I made it out of some parts that you can just buy at a hobby shop. A speed control, a little regulator, and a uh, servo um, controller here. And that kind of helps on uh, um, centering it, finding the center with the eyes. And uh, if you're interested in something like this, you can build them cheap you can find someone that's going to throw away one of these satellite dishes because they're the old eight foot satellite dishes and eventually I'll be mounting this on the ground and uh, on a permanent spot and I'll be tracking uh, with some photoelectric cells is what I'm aiming to do right now or otherwise if you look over there I have a uh, what they call a Fresnel lens over here and that throws out a bunch of light too not actually light but heat if you track the sun here it's just like a big old big old uh, magnifying glass and it gets really 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 hot so you can you can use that to focus on some water or a pipe uh, with this thing here to keep the sun going through that Fresnel lens onto a hot surface here and it'll track it all day long so you could be boiling water all day long you could be uh, maybe boiling like a little boiler and then uh, pipe that stuff into the house I mean there's a, there's a bunch of uh, things you could do with a solar tracker like this and then I put up these wind gen this wind generator I built about three years ago there was a guy on the internet that said that you build it out of PVC pipes that the blades will come apart in four months well here's proof three years later the thing is still running like a charm I had one problem with the hub getting a little bit wore out on the motor where the set suit screws come loose so what I recommend is actually putting a pin all the way through you drill a hole all the way through your hub and the motor shaft and then pin it right to it it's probably a better idea that way you won't have no trouble and this one over here is actually a Norton hydraulic system you can buy oh they're four or five hundred dollars or something I bought it real cheap here and stuck it up that one's up about 30 feet and the blue one over here is up about 20 feet and the winds are about, I don't know, seven, eight, ten miles an hour today. But and that up there is a a DC motor on there that'll put out various voltages as the wind increases. So and that's hooked up to a 12 volt battery pack downstairs. And it's been going for three years. Battery's been lasting for three years. I bought the batteries used, and we're liking that. But this is my new. Uh, solar tracker system made out of RC parts basically for radio control parts in the black box there and these two eyes are basically the eyes that you use at night uh, when you want to turn your lights on at uh, dusk and off at dawn well these are the eyes that do that like for your outside lights I just encased them in a little thing here and so that they're water or they're, they're weatherproof and it's been tracking the sun just great and as you see the sun is just over here a little bit and and uh, at night then it, it returns back to home waits for the sun again so it's been a good 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 little thing and uh, well if you're interested shoot me an email or whatever and we'll go from there talk to you later thanks bye